another developing story in Cooper City where one mosque's plans to expand are rubbing some of their neighbors the wrong way. Local 10's Terrell Fournay is live to show us. Terrell. And this issue will be debated this evening here at City Hall. But the plan to build this new temple has actually been in the works for years. Let's show you this video starting with this rendering. The Nur Ul Islam wants to build a, a new three-story school building and a mosque with three minarets. Now, minarets, those are those towers typically constructed atop mosques that traditionally are used to call for Muslim prayer. The issue is over the proposed height for one of those minarets, 100 feet. So the operators of the mosque are seeking a variance. This is being met with a lot of opposition. The project, though, is slated to grow the current home and site of the mosque near Sterling Road in Southwest 106th Avenue in Cooper City. The plan was originally approved by Broward County years ago, but the land has since been annexed into Cooper City and the deal timed out. Still, mosque leaders have agreed to uh, various drainage and traffic improvements to that area. And the city's own planning and zoning board, they have given an official recommendation to pass this measure. Out live now here outside of uh, Cooper City City Hall, it is expected to be a packed commission meeting tonight with people weighing in on both sides of this issue. We will be inside for it all and have the very latest for you later on tonight on Local 10. That's the latest live from Cooper City. Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News. Okay, look forward to hearing your report later. Thank you so much.